And remember this man? We originally thought his name was Timothy, another local man looking for a young girl. But he turned out to be this man, Robert Feinstein, a Langhorn businessman who promotes wrestling events. He has his own website with plenty of pictures of himself. We tried to catch up with him at his office and his home. But each time he saw us, he ran. And according to his chat log, he thought he was meeting a 14-year-old boy. Uh, Joey's teacap is here. Joey teacap, that, you know, that, that guy. <laughs> Joey's not funny. Who's Kelly? Joey. Yo, it's time to tune in to Joey's To Catch a Predator channel. He's gonna give you the backstory. He's gonna show you where they are today. This is Seizure Machine. Let's go. Since 2015, oh, oh. Joey's TCAP. We got hey, what's up? You're hot. Thanks. You got pics? I'm from Langhorn. Yeah. Here, I got a bunch www.rohwrestling.com backslash image2.jpg You a wrestler? Yepers. Cool, cool. You got mail. You got a pic that I can see you better? OMG, you're hot. Question mark. I'm sending you four more. Do you have any more pics? No, what I got is my own pictures. I don't got my own cam. Cool, cool. Where are you from? I am just here for winter break. Oh, cool. Where are you from? You know where Chicago is? <laughs> LOL. I'm going there in April for a show. Yeah, I have been there before also. Okay, like near there in Barrington? Nah, you got mail. But my dad lives here. You got mail. Wow, you're hot. Thanks. You know where Newton Square is here? How long are you here for? Hmm. It sounds familiar. Is it Bucks County? I'm in Langhorn. I go home Friday. KK, where's that near? Where are you now? At my dad's. Hmm, you're not on my buddy list. You're so hot also. Edited MapQuest link to Buzz House. It just sucks here. Why? Do you got a car? Well, I don't know no one, and my dad let my sister bring a friend. A frowny face. No, I don't get my license for two more years. Okay. My sister does. OMG, you're so cute. Yeah, but I never got a boyfriend. Why? It's hard, and I don't want no one to know. Well, you're like me. I'm super straight acting. I don't like gay gay guys. I like straight acting guys. Me too. Smiley face. But you're old and can go meet people. Well, not that old. How old are you? 23. Actually, I think he's 32. Yeah, but that's older than me, and you can drive and drink. I'm 14, and no one ever wants to go see me, because they say I'm jailbait, and I can't meet guys my own age, because they might tell guys at school. Damn, 14. See? Well, I'll pretend you said 18. I look 18. I can buy smokes. You're so adorable. Damn, you're a, a little like 40 minutes from me. Or we could chill. Then my dad went to Texas tonight till Tuesday, and my sister dropped him off. So now I'm, like, stuck here, and they gave me 20 bucks not to tell. But they said they are taking the car to New York tomorrow, so then I got nothing to do. Frowny face. Well, have them drop you to meet me. On the way. How old is your sister? 17. She's a senior. KK. Well, it sucks. Well. Is New York a long drive? Maybe 90 minutes. I bet the get fucked. Going there. Like not sex fuck, but fuck something up. I knew what you meant. Then I'll bust. Ha ha. Well, you are so my type in the looks department. You got a boyfriend? Just broke up after two years in December. I never had one. Frowny face. Why would chill? But you're so far. 45 minutes from me. Well, take a train here. Ha. I don't know how here. I can at home. Damn. Well... You do lots of guys? No, I had a boyfriend for two years. I wish I did. I'll be in Chicago Ridge, April 24th, Frontier Fieldhouse. I can get any place in Chicago, but not allow downtown. Cool. Is that downtown? No. You got a job? Wrestling is my job. Like you get paid for it? Yeah. Damn, that's way cool. You shake your hair on you? Yeah, well, all the time. I love being smooth. And you? No, I don't got hair. I mean, I do wear it should, but not like my chest. 
Oh, I'll come get you. Huh? I would pick you up. Not now. My sister is here, and she would think shit. KK. You got more pick? Hmm. You're so hot. Thanks. You don't got X ones. Well, no. I want some, but don't got a cam. What are you into? I wanted a cam for Christmas, but didn't get it. You got mail. Do you kiss or don't do that? I def do. Lots of guys I talk to on here say they don't. Okay, guess you're busy. No, I was sending you a pic, and when it downloads, it locks me, and I can't type. I am only talking to you. What are you into? I love boarding, and I am getting really good. Cool, nice. There's just not lots of places around me at home to do it, and when we come here, we don't go anywhere. My dad's not rich like my mom's new husband. That kind of sucks. Do peeps know your game? A few friends that I sit. A few friends that is it. What about you? Fuck no. Well, I don't want no one to. Cool. It's all good. Did you, like, live with your boyfriend? Yeah. He lived here for two years. Sucks. He is going to miss him to death. We got into a fight over something stupid. So, like, you guys stayed in that same bed all the time? He never worked, ever. No, next to mine. Only a few times. He was an odd one. Super closet case. Long story. He said he could not be gay. <laughs> he said he could not be gay with me anymore. Plus, I wanted him to get a job. I mean, a job. I spent like $10,000 on him in two years. Easy. How did he get money if he didn't have a job? I took him to Florida to Disney World for a week. Me! I paid. I was in love with him, and he used me. Huge. I mean, I don't have to work because I can't and got school. As soon as I told him he needed to get a job, he got into a fight with me over something stupid and said he wanted to move back home. He's young also, just turned 20, was 18 when we met. Yeah, well, he dropped out. Oh. He didn't go to college? He looks like Aaron Carter. Nah, he's stupid, Paul. We have not talked in two months. For real. We lived together for like two years, talked every day, hang 24-7, and poof, all gone. I cried for like a month straight. I had to get above like a 3.5, so I can't go to Northwestern. He was like my best friend. Nice. I like the pic of you in the red shirt. That's our basement. Cool. That's where we hang. Damn. Wish you lived closer. Or at least not in Illinois. Why? Duh, lol. You're hot also. You want to be like boyfriends? Lol. I gotta get to know you. Plus, you're 14, lol. I would be a great friend. Maybe more. Who knows? Yeah, I hear that a lot. Can you talk on the phone at all if I called you? I mean, if you liked me, I could, like, say I want to live with my dad. Don't worry. I don't sound gay. That would rule. I don't want to talk on the phone because my sister is here and this place is so small. KK, it's okay. Well, maybe another day. Do you, like, work every day? Yeah, 9 to 5. Work at the wrestling office. You look like my friend a lot. I like your hair also. Hooped! What have you done before? You mean sex? Ha. I only met one guy I did stuff with. How old was he? He said 25, but looked lots older. If you don't mind, what did you do? Why did you stop talking? Didn't. Sorry. I was looking at your pic. Well, I'm looking at yours also. Do you know The Rock? Here, I'll show you stuff. Yeah, I met them all. So, you like WWE? Oh, and that guy was freak. He just stuck to me and then made me get out of his car. That is messed up. We didn't even kiss. RF video, web link edited out six times, and then Xavier puts in a note. Each one of these was the link to a picture of him and various wrestlers that worked for him. Some of them appear to be down, meaning the links, I guess, not the wrestler. Me and Eddie Guero. So, do you want to wrestle them? Yeah. The blonde is Sonny from WWE. What's your name on there? I don't think I've seen you. Rob, I'm not in WWE. In something else. PWG. Okay, Xavier puts another note. Yet another lie. Pro Wrestling Gorilla is based on the West Coast, and Rob does not work for or own them. Rob reveals why he is telling so many lies later in this conversation. Oh. Anyhow, lol. I'm bored. Lol. Tonight. Not now, though. You know lots of Pete. So, so. Do you? Have you ever been with a girl? One time. Did you bang her? No, I fingered her, but the stink. <laughs> well, oh. <laughs> Why are you on winter break now? 
because it's winter break, duh. Well, you were waiting to use a duh on me to get me back, so we are duh even. Haha, ha, no. I go to year round, so our breaks are fucked. Cool. Like, spring break is in May. Okay, cool. So, do you butt fuck? Okay, I'm sorry. I just wanted to know if it hurt. Well, 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 it's okay. I used to fear it and scared to do it. Only did it four times. It rocks. But it has to be with the right person and all. It don't hurt? For the first minute. Then nothing. What are you looking to do and all? I want more than just getting sucked and running. I mean, I want to, like, to kiss and, like, see stuff. What is running? Like, that guy saying, get out of my car. Yeah, well, that, that is fucked up. Well, I'm not a runner. Do you like wrestle, or are you just like the coat? Sucks you can't get your sister to meet me at a mall on your way to NYU or something. Then get picked up. You can come here, like, tomorrow, because they be gone. Maybe I will. You never says if you like wrestle or, or like, coach. No, I wrestle in all. But not like the guys from WWE. Bingo. Oh, you big. How tall are you? So, who do you wrestle? Do I know them? You won't know them. Well, I'm like 5'7". Okay. You look tall. 5'10". 5'11". Yeah, you're tall. I would deaf kiss you. That would be hot. Cool, cool. You got a webcam? No, worry. Sorry. I asked for one for Christmas and didn't get it. Oh, my dog ate mine. Well, look, I'm going to go to bed now, I think. Add me to your buddy list. No, stay, please. No, KK, okay, okay. So, like, can we meet tomorrow and hang? Well, I work and all, but I'll be online during the day, and we can figure something out. You promise? Your sister has to really drive near me. Actually, to go to New York. She should drop you off. Bribe her, well. That would mean I gotta give her back the 20 she gave me. And she wants, because if I get busted... She gets busted. Then she gets busted for taking my dad's car out to Newton Square. And my mom finds out, and my dad gets in trouble. True. Don't do it, Lol. You're so hot. Well, thanks, man. So are you. For real. What's your name? I'm Brandon. Cool. What's yours? Rob. Wait, that link you sent me just said Rob, like, Rob owns the wrestler? Yeah, I do. But I don't know you yet, and I'm really scared to tell you everything about me. Xavier's note again? Hence, some of his lies in the chat log. Rob here is very cautious. He knows how much he has to lose. Did you see the one group pick with everyone? Notice how I'm in the middle of a pick. They all work for me. I know. I always think like I am talking to someone here, and they are going to be the guys from my school, and they're going to tell everyone. Well, me too. Yeah, but if you, like, own that place, then they cannot be dicks, because you're the boss. Well, that is true. See, I'm smart. Well, me too. Wish it was tomorrow now. I wish it was Friday. Then you would be gone, well. Yeah, but you won't like me, and I'm me used to that. Why do you say that? Because guys never do. They just say shit. Well, I will. How do you own all these guys and are 23? I'm rich. Well, I started my company at 18. Really? I swear. You didn't go to college? You have a cute smile. I did. I graduated. Where'd you go? Temple for RTF. Radio, TV, and film. My mom always says I will be like my dad if I don't go to college. Well. I like my dad. He's just, like, not rich. Well. My, my dad is really fun, and my mom's new husband is rich but really a dick. Really? That sucks. Did you fly here? Yeah, and my mom said if my dad don't pay me next time, we can't come. Did your arms get hurt? Ha ha. Well. You sound fun. I am. Did you know you were gay when you were 14? Yeah. Dude, I knew when I was maybe 10 or 11. I did too. In school, I always had crushes on my friends. Did you do stuff with them? Yeppers, lol. I was straight at the time and all, just experimenting. Yeah. You weren't freaked to try. No, I wanted to. I do too, but what if someone tells and then no one likes it? Yeah, well, you gotta be careful. I was on homecoming court this year, and I'm really liked. 
It happened with me and my friends when we found his dad's porn. Plus, I would hint at my friends first and feel them out, and then say I was joking if they were not into it. So, you watched porn, and how did you do it? Yeah, jerked off together. That's it? Yeah, when I was in high school, we blew each other and stuff. I always got freaked out afterwards and hated doing it, and would go down on myself. But then I got used to it. That's why... I want to meet a guy here and do stuff so one from no one can know. Yeah, I hear you. But then if I like you and you like me, that will suck. I mean, I already really like you lots. You're so hot. Thanks, for real. You're cool also. Well, I have to get to bed now. For real, so tomorrow can come quicker. Well, plus, I'm beat. Be good on here now that we met. Well, I really like you. I like you also. I mean, you're not, like, asking me to jack off or do phone shit. You're a hottie. Both guys always do that. That is corny, perverted shit. I'm a normal man, not a freak. There's lots of freaks on here. No shit, well. So, you swear you'll be online tomorrow? I will, but it will be, like, around noontime. I can wait if you promise. I promise. We'll talk on the phone also tomorrow, so you know I'm not some old fart or something. Can you hang here or not? You mean your house? Yeah. Yeah, but I don't got a way to get there. I don't know where anything is here. Okay, well, maybe tomorrow. I can get you or something. I don't know where that is, but my friend is a pro at getting around. He's my roommate and is straight, but his man knows about me. He don't care. You're going to bring a bud? At all. No! If I get you, I can get him to drive me. If it freaks you out, it's cool. I don't want you to be all worried and shit. I'm not a serial killer. Oh. What if we like each other and want to do stuff and he is watching? No, he won't, Paul. We can come here and chill here. I got a huge-ass house. He won't be with me. Show me on map. Just for the drive. And he gave a neighbor's house number, but we found him two doors down. In Langhorne, Pennsylvania. It's like 45 minutes, but the way I drive, 30 minutes. Yeah, it does look far. Well, I have an idea where you are near. We can work all that out tomorrow. It's like my house to downtown Chicago. One thing is, don't say your age. Plus, the train goes through the hood, so I'm not allowed to use it there. No, I want, and I can act like old. I don't want my roomie thinking I'm an oddball. Okay, cool. He will be like, why are you with him? He's young. I say to Pete that I go to community college. We go to Northwestern to party and they believe me. Nice. Okay, well, it's time to cuddle with my pillow. Catch you tomorrow. You promise? Kissy face, yeah. If you give me a number, I'll call you tomorrow. You give me the time to call. Or just wait till then. Your call. When I see you online, you can tell me it. My dad has calls forwarded to his cell from like 8 to 6 because he runs his business out of the house and only has the one phone and a fax line, so I can only call out. Okay, okay. Tomorrow, you can call me. I use my calling card because my mom freaks when she sees how long I talk and I get grounded. Also, if you IM me and I don't respond, I always leave AOL on, so I'm not around. I won't say shit, because I had that happen once, and my sister saw. Well, you can say anything. It's at my house, in my room. Nobody will see but me. Okay, well, it's bedtime. Talk to you tomorrow. Later, and thanks. Yepers. Night, smiley face. Hey, in car, give me 30. K. Kissy face. Hi, you there? BK, sup? What's up? Took a shower. Bored. Cool. What time are you allowed out till? Hey, I like really, really worked this. See, my sister went to New York, so I got a cover for her. So I told her I went to go hang at this place someone said was close and like peace my age hang there. So I told her when I talked to dad, I'm going to saw we are all going to a movie so we can like stay out late. And she knows what we said. So I so and I made it more to look like I was trying to cover for her. Cool. Can you call me real quick? K. 215-949-8708. I'm paranoid. Well, edited address. K. Beck, is your house like in a development? Kind of like just lots of houses. They are like old, not my mom's in Barrington. You sound way older. You sure you're not a cop? 
fuck no, told you I'm go to a party at Northwestern and peeps believe I'm like in community college because I can be like them. I don't get proofed for smokes. Ha ha. Question mark. Debating. What I said? Nothing wrong. Then why are you not talking? Oh, I'm just thinking. Nothing is wrong looking at the map. Are you working now? Yeah, here now. I'm sorry for whatever I did. You didn't do a thing. For real. You just sound older. Well... Then why are you not saying anything? You said you don't like girly guys, so I was trying hard to sound so you would like me. Well, true. Here, call me back again. I don't want to. You mad? You liked me before I called. Now you are acting weak. It's just I'm nervous, that is all. And when you called before, someone came in here, so I could not even talk. I'm kind of nervous, too, because I was up to, like, three just looking at your pit. Well, why? Why that? Why are you nervous? Because you might be not like the guy who you say you are, not the guy in the pics, or the guy I talk to, and I like you. Oh, trust me, that is me. I'm going to take my phone with me in the car. My cell, that is. I want to go to the gym. You can call me on that if you want. Do you still like me? Yeah, I do. But now, you don't want to hang out. It's okay, I'm used to it. Well, I never said I don't. I do want to. I'm going to lift now, and I'll be back on here. I can get you when I'm done. If you want, your call. Or we can talk another day and do it tomorrow. What time? No, my dad gets back tomorrow, and then we do shit with him till we leave. Hmm. I lift for like 60 minutes to 90 minutes. Okay, okay. Well, let me lift, and then I will IM you. And we can go from there. You swear? I definitely want to talk to you again, though. Yeah. What kind of music do you like? So, like, three, because I'm going to go to McDonald's and eat. Okay. You swear? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Talk to you later. Bye. Still looking, I see. No, bored. Just looking at dicks if they will send. Well, okay. So if I come and get you, where am I coming to? My dad's house, duh. Actual house? Yeah. Am I knocking on the door? Well, okay, I'm leaving now to shower, then I'm leaving to get you. It's just me. KK, well, do you want me to IM you when I'm home? You're going to have to give me your Addy again. KK, when I get home. K, when you get home. Want to call me on my drive so I'm not bored? Nope. I don't got lots of time left on my card, but will and forget the 20 to get more. How long it take you to get home? 10 minutes. We can talk for like five. Well, want the number so I can jet. K. 267-278-4085. Call me. K. Leaving now, later. Hey, I can't do it, man. Your age is bad. I would if you were 18. Not looking for any stupid trouble and not looking for sex for one night. I'm not a pervert or a pedo. You're hot if that is you. So good luck and shit. What did I say? That people always get scared. You're right. I want to I wanna trust me. I'm not the type that wants to get in trouble. I don't get it. I legit was driving home, and I was like, what am I doing? If you were older, I would be there. Hey, I'm used to it. Like, I said old guys always want to see me and get off on the phone, but no one ever likes me for real. Well, no, I would, but no sex. I'm not getting in trouble. It's not fair. Would you just want to chill? It's totally up to you. But I wanted to meet you like a dude. I could do more, not just chill. And I know you don't want to because I'm young and it will be hard not to try stuff. Well, it's up to you. You there? Yeah. It's your call. I'm really bummed. No one ever likes me and I get it, but it sucks. Well, that is because of your age. It sucks. Let's just hang out. I was up to like three looking at your picture Thinking of how hot it was going to be to kiss and shit. Do you know a guy who is like you that might like me? Like me in what way? Hot, nice, and not baggy. But you're leaving on Friday anyhow. I know, but I am here and I can try because no one here knows me, so no one will ever know not like home. You don't get it. I do understand. So now you want... Talk to me. I am waiting, well, to hear you say, come get me. Well, I don't get it. I will tell you in person when I know it's you. Well, it is me. I don't get it. I know. 
Well, it's your call. When we see each other and when we realize it's really us, I will be more relaxed. So you do still like me? I never didn't. You know how like when someone says something and it's like your heart gotten taken out? (laughs) Yes. Well, relax and trust me. I do, or I wouldn't tell you where I was. You're not like the guys who want phone sex or ask my dick size. I thought you really liked me, but I know you don't have to because I am not from here. Okay, how is this? I'll head home, shower, and I am you. You're not at home? No, I came back here. I can be home in 15 minutes. Okay, you swear? Yeah, talk to you in 15. Okay. Yo. Hi. What up? I know you got mad. Why? I never got mad. Because I was in the room again. No, that don't bother me. I won't go in again, I promise. No, for real. It's cool. I just never did this before. Most people are my age, you know? It's just all weird. Like spring break, I get and all. But like how your sister, who is only 17, going to New York for a party on a Monday is odd. But it's all good. I don't know if they are going to party. They just wanted to go... I just say party. KK, okay, well, do you want me to come and get you? I can shower and leave. We go to your place? Yeah. What should I put on? Clothes, lol. Duh. Lol. Whatever you want. I don't judge people what they wear. Link me again to your addy. What are you going to wear? My clothes. I'm coming to your house, right? Yeah. I'll knock for you. Hey. Well, I need your addy again. Oh, yeah. Edited. What time you get here? I got to shower again. Well, it says 45 minutes. I don't believe that, but I need to shower also. If I had a number on you, I would call when I'm close. I would say six-ish. It goes to my dad's cell to like six. KK. That late? Maybe earlier. Might be traffic. I jacked off again looking at you, so I will shower. Okay, well, I'm going to the shower now. I'll am you before I leave, okay? Okay. Cool. Peace. Bye. Did you leave? Yeah. Oh, your thing doesn't show your mobile. I am. Kay, I won't bug you. I'm gonna shower. Kay. You there? Question mark? Rob, are you okay? Where are you? Is that car a lease? Kay, I'll call you later. <laughs> Is that car a lease? We're pulling up your records. Oh, God. Okay, so then Xavier says, during these... The time of these conversations, Rob was called on the phone twice by my underage-sounding verifier. I'm sure you noticed the mention of it. What follows is a transcript done from memory right after the second conversation was over. The individual doing the call is a different individual from the person who did the chat. So this is a uh, like a transcript of the phone call because they didn't record the call. Yeah. Hey. Hey, dude. What's up? Not much, just hanging, drinking some water, which is so boring. Why is that? Because it's water, dude. Oh, yeah, right. You sound older. And that's cool, right? Well, um, yeah, you know, I'm just a little paranoid, you know, your age. Paranoid about what? I just, you know, I don't want people to find out. I don't want that either. I get the shit kicked out of me. By who? Guys at school. Oh, back in Chicago? Yeah. Man, this kind of feels like an honor. Why's that? Because you're, like, famous and stuff. I've been hanging around your website, digging your pics. Oh, yeah? Which ones? Like that one with you on stage with the shirt and those sleeves. Totally hot. Oh, God. Well, I liked it. What time you gotta be home tonight? I'm probably good till, like, 11.30. That late, huh? Dude, it's just me here. Oh, right. Your sister went to a party. Yeah. How'd she get directions? Man, I don't care. That's odd. What is? How'd she get directions to New York? To the party? Dude, how should I know? That's her fucking life. That's just odd. Driving for a party on a Tuesday? You really do sound older. Then 14? Yeah. Thanks. When's your sister getting back? Man, I stay out of her life, and I keep her the fuck out of mine. Oh, that's cool. Let's go back online. It's easier. Okay. Here's the second call. Hey. Stop. Not much. Can I ask you something? And I really need you to be straight with me. Sure. Does my voice turn you off? Oh, no, no. It's just you sound older, and I don't want you to be a cop. 
Dude, I'd be a lousy fucking cop. It's just your age. Yeah. Th- man, this voice comes in handy. How? Like, if I want to skip, I can just call the school and say I'm my dad or shit like that. Well, I don't know. Aw, oh, man. I see it like this. I feel like this has been the best shot I ever had at doing this stuff. And I've been screwed before. Didn't I tell you about that time with that guy in his car? Where was that again? Chicago. Man, I just don't want to get caught. How can you get caught? Dude, if you come over and we do this and it doesn't work out, bam, I'm on a plane Friday and you don't ever got to worry about me. Do you like it in Chicago? Eh, it's okay, but people suck. What's that? People suck. So you really can't hang out after tomorrow? Nah, my dad's coming back and we're going to have to do family stuff, which sucks. Yeah. And not in the good way. Ha! Hey, can you do me a favor? You name it. Do you have MTV? Yeah. Can you turn it on? Um, yeah. Why? Because cops wouldn't have MTV at the station. Make sure I can hear it. Is that true? <laughs> I wonder if that's true. Yeah, just like um, my druggy friends told me that uh, if you ask a cop if he's a cop, they have to tell you by law. Also, yeah. cops are not allowed to listen to MTV at the station. It's like a rule. Yeah. Whatever, dude. At this point, I turn on MTV and crank it. The artist, I think, is Christina uh, Aguilera. Can you hear that? Yeah. I'm watching some dude getting into a car, slow motion. Now some blonde bitch. Okay, I believe you. (laughs) Too late, man. I'm catching a groove. Okay. Uh, You can turn that down already. (laughs) And the music goes off. Man, and that was almost the kind of music I like. Oh, yeah? What kind of music do you like? All right, I'll tell you. But if I do, I'm not taking any shit for it, all right? Sure. I like old, angry kick rock. Like Elena's uh, Morissette. Oh, yeah. What song? Ironic. Want to hear me sing it? Uh, no, that's okay. No command performance necessary. So we got to wrap this soon because this card's going to run out. No problem. I tell you what, I need your address again. You want it now? No, send it to me and I am. I'm almost home. Then I'm going to sign on, get your address, put it in my pilot, shower, and then I'll head over. Video footage that aired on television to a local affiliate of you going up to a house where they say that you expected to find a young child inside. What? Here's the details. This is exactly what happened. And, and it had nothing to do with child pornography or anything like that. Um, and, and they weren't the guys that actually caught me on video either. Here, here's the real story. This is exactly Shoot. what happened. Um, it was February 28th. I was in an adult chat room for adults on AOL. It had nothing to do with myself being in children's chat rooms. I was not on the internet stalking little kids or anything like this. I was in AOL and I was in an adult chat room. I was approached by somebody person's profile i don't know if you guys are familiar with aol where you can check somebody's profile mm-hmm. we are well, well this person's profile you know said, uh, a college student had a bunch of information um i don't know if you guys know about profiles where you can click on the link and you can see pictures of the person mm-hmm. this person had three pictures of themselves they were not naked or anything like that and it was clear as day that it was an adult it was it was not a child whatsoever mm-hmm. and in fact a very well-known wrestling journalist over here in the united states along with a lot of other people when the story first broke saw the pictures and he will tell you that it was never a 14 year old person it was a college person i got into a conversation with the person online over uh i believe it was a two-day period um had a lot of similar interests and stuff like that and i talked to him for the first day everything was fine he told me a lot of stuff a lot of stuff that he was telling me seemed shady but i related to a lot of his problems that he was going through um, I talked to him the next day. When I talked to him the next day, he wanted to meet me. I was very, you know, hesitant to meet him. And I talked to him on the phone a couple times. When I talked to this person on the phone, it was clear as day that it was an adult. It would be like me talking to you right now. You can tell from the person's voice, very mature, um, had a conversation with them. Even on the computer, very mature. And it, it was never, I, I don't know if you guys read the, tra- the chat transcript, but I never, ever initiated any sexual talk at all. I was not a pervert. Um, there was this person that was trying to lure me in and, and get me to discuss a bunch of stuff that, you know, I'm not even into. So, basically what happened, I told the person, before I even went up to go meet, I said, if we hang out, I am not having sex. I said, I'm not into that at all. I am coming up there to be your friend. 
and I said, it is your choice if you want me to come up there. Did you, I said, did on, you say on this in chat or did you say this on the phone? What's that? Did you say this what you say now? That's in the transcript. You can read it. Mm -hmm.